Hello folks, today I'm going to show you how to host a website in Utopia Network or any other service within the Utopia decentralized ecosystem. Utopia client comes with a very comprehensive help file. It has a dedicated section on hosting websites within Utopia Network and it has further divided it into various parts which give you a very clear picture of what is what and how to go about it. This is action within the help file which says that Utopia is a unique ecosystem specifically designed to protect privacy of communication security of personal data. It also says one very interesting thing that if you host a website in Utopia, your actual hosting location is hidden. That is true per se, but the Utopia client on which machine it will be running, on which internet it will be running, that internet IP address can be exposed through your website. So you have to be careful about that and we'll cover this in another section sometime. The help file also shows a very illustrative procedure of hosting the websites within Utopia. But we'll close it for now and let's go ahead and do a practical demonstration of hosting it ourselves. I wanted to host utopia.ecology.co on the network but due to some issue I couldn't do that. The, the Utopia network is kind of buggy right now but it is being fixed, no worries. I've listed all the Utopia websites on the right side you can see and I'll keep adding more websites whichever and whenever they come. You can remember this URL and you can open it on ClearNet. Now for today we are going to open, uh, we are going to host paste.trhack.net on the Utopia framework. So let's get ahead and go to tools uns manager here we'll have to register the uns record now it has to be same as your website if your website or your subdomain let's suppose if your website is google.com so you have to register google.com here and then it would open because the http headers will match only then if your website is drhack.net then you'll enter drhack.net if it's ecology.co you'll enter the same it is very important here that the UNS register is exact as your domain. If it is ecology.co, our website should also be ecology.co. The reason behind it, so that the HTTP headers match and if your website is behind Cloudflare or even if it's uh, on a shared hosting, it will still work. Let's register some domain.com as UNS record. We click next. You can see this is the field of the network and let's click register. And after a while, the pending will be changed into confirm. Now our UNS record has been registered. But here we will be using paste.trhack.net, which is already registered. The procedure is the same, and from here we'll go forward. You can see that some of the websites are having a world icon in front of their names these are those websites which have packeting packet forwarding enabled which means that they are associated with the website inside the utopia network while page.drhack.net does not have any as of now but after our demo it will have one next click on packet forwarding this is where you can set up your website and associate it with an external ip address this screen also shows a hint which has some description for your aid and it says to proceed please register at least one UNS record and configure packet forwarding for it by specifying IP and port of any local or external destination. Now let's click add. Here we'll select the UNS record of paste.drhack.net. Then we'll set the port. 80. Now you can find out your IP address by simply pinging your website, uh, ping followed by your domain and that's it. So here you can see this is the IP address, it's a Cloudflare based IP address. 
So I'll enter it under the IP address field and I enter the port 80 and I'll start check this immediately start option and hit the create button. Now you can see that page.yarhack.net packet forwarding at port 80 has been created and as you have checked that pattern it is also enabled. Now we'll add another record. We are again select page.drhack.net but this time we will enter port 443 for HTTPS or SSL. Same IP address again for port 3 and create. Now you can see both have been created. So I will disable them for now and I will show you that they will not work. When I enter page.drhack.net you will see it will keep on loading and loading and loading. Now let's stop it here and uh, enable them, both of them. And now we'll see page.drhack.net. And bam, here you go. So we have tested the website and it works inside the Itopia network. And this is the procedure how you can add it. Uh, I already have added my websites and they are ported onto Utopia just for testing sake. You can also have even added duckduckgo.com and google.co.uk. You can also add more and share your experience. And if there's anything you want me to add or improve or anything I've said wrong, uh, please note it's a beta software so things keep changing. And it's quite possible that might have said something which is not uh, up to date after like two days or so. So hope it helped you. And I think that's about all. Take care.